Arcane Lineage and sadly this is not the first video I actually made the first video I actually had no audio of it but I can tell you everything I do I show you everything I do so the first thing I did when I came in game is to look for the quest board which I did just grab one quick quest the mushroom quest never worked for me so I ended up taking the slime quest I spoke to this guy he will teach you skills so when you talk to him I ask if I kill three slimes I'm a teacher this skill that is called um, days right and then you can come around here who was it that gave me the quest is either this guy or a guy in the same position on the next side it's either him or him that gave me a quest to go to the desert to deliver something for your friend but when I went ahead and do so I learned that I was not as strong as I should be to go into the desert so yeah I don't know if I did a quest there I spoke with this guy and he would say to you let me show you any around here can train me and he must say sure the guard captain outside to my left can teach you something. So you come here and turn to your left. And you speak to this guy. And he will literally teach you skills. See there? Him, him just literally teach me an next skill. To see a skill, you have to either reset or just go to the source selection. You can show you what the source selection is. That's all I need to do. I need to load, yeah? And you're gonna come here where you see the bugger eyes. No matter where you go, they might go follow you. So in a minute sense, this is where you can go and get different characters. You just need to go back to your character and you should be fine. Once you press the button again, you would see a new skills. Dark Slash is a job that I got. It was a scroll. Haven't even tested it out as yet. But it is what it is. Everything that you need have an icon. This is the potion shop. It, this area right here is where you go buy your, your sword, whatever weapon you want. Cestos, Daga, Staff, Spear, Sword. They don't have no great sword though. You have a next area where you can do banking. Here, so is where you get drinks and food. So if you need food, this is the place to be. Oh, and you can gamble too. Cool. Alright. I didn't realize how to gamble. This here is your bank, and this over here is where you're going to sell your items. This guy can someday make armor for you once you have the, the schematics. You meditate here, and this is where you level up. So this is what them call the spirit domain. You see the same evil eyes. Don't know what them do, but I'm gonna plan to find out as yet. You also have a guy in the spirit domain. It's not your spirit domain, other players can come in. You talk to him and him can bring out a sky where you pay Roblox for. 
But this is the most important part. You talk to our team or whatever his name is. You ask him to show you light. He might show you say this increase your level and it require your 46. 46 are this blue flames which is called essence. You click it, you give your option to put three things in your stats. Three skill points in your stats. So if you want to have more damage, you put it here. If you want, if you are a magic person, you put it here. If you want more HP, you put it here. Here's for more speed. Here's for your drop lock. The whatever race I am, give me two already in my drop lock. Don't know why. Do you even know the different races in game as yet? No, no, you have a monkey one, a demon one, a regular human one some other ones I really haven't explored the game that much you know every and everything but every time you finish your you think you finish your quest you come speak to this guy and I'm gonna say you bring in the stuff for your guild request you say yes you handle it in he will literally say they will do and you say okay uh, so yeah this is what the whole kind of race look like don't know what the stats of them get. Um, slime investigation, please. I'm gonna finish my quest, I'm gonna cancel it then. Alright. Wants a few samples of slimes from outside. Bro! I'm just take my quest. Well, I can show them my different, different skills. I'm gonna see what them look like. You just need to walk up and down out here. Or if you see something that is physically out there, you can walk up to it and you get your, your fight. Oh, I'm gonna never block that. I'm gonna never block that neither. Thank God him feel. Alright, Pummel Strike don't take much. Bash your enemy with the base of your scroll. Have a chance of stunning. And my feel that if you try make you go in at the blue area there, which <laughs> sadly I never ever get to do. I never ever get the chance to do that. Never get it right yet. But at least my block that look a bit. Now we must steal money. <laughs> no matter if you steal the money, you gotta always get the chance. Dark slash, please make this work. Tell me it work? No. Do I have to get all of it in there? Or could I get half? Dodge. Okay, <laughs> money. You to know. I see days here, I'm not going to do all of that with this. Nice. <laughs> days doing on its own. Pummel strike. Tell me say it work. Yeah. Alright, so I now forget all of it. I just need to forget a good amount of it. More than what outside. I still want to show on a dark slash. Let me heal up first. Because, as you can see with my local diamond here, or my local crystal, it's quarter away. So I died two times in the game. And if that blue part goes empty, I become corrupted. And I don't know if corrupted mean I go wipe, or if I get corrupted, then lose all of the purple inside, then I get wipe. I'm not sure, I really know how to find out and I try regain it, but I don't know how to do that either. So the point is, no more dying. Permit strike. Ah, I get more 13. 
Im dodge it. No fear. <laughs> That's no fear. Bro, just dodge it. I ain't even want to dodge that though. Dodge. Um, dark slash. More on. Showing a dark slash. Please tell me it work. No. Alright, we can't, can't afford to die yet. I'm literally just say no more dying. Nice. So I just need to worry about one. That shouldn't be too much of an issue. Let me see if we can get double slash off. What? That 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 just does that look a bit baby damage eh? That's baby damage. Tell me that work. No. Alright, I mean if we kill him no. Inside for heal, not no spawn for me. Alright, so the only thing I'm gonna get for sure now are uh, Dark Slash. But if you play the game, you get drops, you get items, and you should be fine. You can constantly go to the. Wait a minute. You can constantly go to the guard. Captain and he will teach you different moves. I don't know how much more moves he will teach. Let me see. Alright, we're going to the next one. Passive learn. Alright, let me try again. Oh, I don't have no more money for him. Do that. Alright, that's fine. But I believe that's it for the video. Guys, the game is rather nice. Although it's not like he would do you know, major combat, but it have the crap. What's the name of that game? I don't have the name on my mind right now, but I'm pretty sure you know the type of game it take up offer. It have the same Pokemon gameplay style, but Final Fantasy, yeah, it have the Final Fantasy type. I'm gonna love it. But thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe.